Today we're gonna be discussing the new Ming Dynasty Ironclad Skin Collection, the Obsidian Edge, and all the new stuff we've been getting. What? Wow! For the motherland! This land is ours. For the motherland! This land is ours! Yeah. So folks, what we're gonna do today is that I'm going to showcase you the new Ironclad collection. We have four new weapon skins, we have the clothes, we have armor skins, we have that spray, we have an ornament, we have all kind of stuff. And then I'm gonna also talk about the price tag and eventually you're gonna see some gameplay as well. First of all, let's check the cinematic together. So if you go to military supply, you're gonna have actually two events. So we have the obsidian edge, which is kind of the katana. And then you have the iron clad, which is more like the cloth itself. I mentioned that I would talk about the price tag, but as a heads up, it's crazy expensive, guys. I saw Said spending 15,000 bonds on these two events and he, he didn't top up. He doesn't have the katana. Anyways, in this event, you're going to have the ironclad. Oh, uh, oh, cinematic, cinematic. Let's check the cinematic. Mm -hmm. So Ming Dynasty renewed 2024 edition. Looks pretty crazy. I wouldn't want to meet those guys. Let's start with the clothes. So the ironclad clothes, the one you have on screen now, this is kind of the main price of this event. I think it looks better on the female character, but all in all, I think this is very nice and it's going to help you like hiding. OK, so especially in dark places, the black suit is going to definitely help you. So this is this is, in my opinion, a very nice skin. And uh, there's some supplementary items that say we're gonna have the ironclad um, um, like the armor collection I like the helmet a lot because I cannot zoom in but you can see that at the back of the helmet we have something like that is an extra and it reminds me of the original arena breakout wallpaper then we have the armor itself and then there's also that uh, ironclad b3 escort rig what I like about the collection is that it's black with a bit of silvery, so it definitely can help you like being in stealth mode. It's harder to spot you because of the darkness. Then we have the motherland. For the motherland, this land is ours. I like that. If I'm going to have a chance, then I'm, I'm, I'm going to spend some um, bonds to get this because I really like that and it it's Almost like the we got the Timmy. Then we have the spray, by the way, which is looking good, but I don't really see players using sprays. I don't know why. Maybe they are just too much focused on the game. But maybe one day we're gonna have sprays all around the maps. Would be nice to like you know spray if you do a kill or spray something when you are spawning. But I don't see any sprays being used at all. What else? So we have the two weapon skins, obviously the Dragon Skin AKS-74U. Uh, <laughs> I played like two or three games with this gun, but it was an absolute disaster on TV station, so I kept dying. On the other hand, with the T951 or T951, I had some decent games, like literally nice ones. Uh, maybe I'm going to put some on screen. Overall, like looking at the skins and the skin design, um, I like it. I like black, I like red, I like dragons. So overall, I, I love this connection. Connection, really shady. Collection. So if I had enough money, um, I would definitely buy that. Jumping over to the obsidian edge. Where is my edge? Where is my katana? There you go. For the motherland, this land is ours. Oops. So in this event, we have the obsidian edge itself. Interestingly, that's not the rarest item. So if you look at that and the chances to get the ironclad gloves, um, that's the like the rarest uh, item. But I think the edge 
like the katana is the one that uh, everybody will want to to get but while i was saying that i think people are like yeah this is super cool but i'm not gonna buy that or not gonna have that because it's like too expensive anyways let's look at the katana um i think this is the best the best uh, melee weapon in the game right now. I love the pickaxe. I like many of the melee skins, but this one is like exceptional. I love the sound effects. I love the whole thing. I love the color. I like that there's a bit of a gloss and um, I'm not sure if I can show it to you, but um, yeah, there's a bit of a dragon texture graved into the edge. So I, I, I think this is an absolute absolute masterpiece i'm definitely not gonna get the skin for free uh therefore i'm i'm a bit hesitating whether if i want to go ahead and spend some real money because <laughs> I, I just i just simply want that let's move on and check the gloves mm, i mean yeah they fit well to the to the overall ironclad skin collection family but I, I, I don't really like them. I, I don't know why. Maybe because of the silver. It's just too much silver. Uh, I don't know. Let's assume that you're going to get the gloves at the last spin. The last spin on its own, it, it's going to cost you 3,880 bonds. Only the last spin, which is tons of money. And I've been trying to talk to the developers. I've been trying to talk to community managers because yeah, we all love these skins, but who can afford these? I mean, really, if you buy everything from the two events, then for that price, you could eventually buy yourself like a cheap phone. I mean, you know, maybe the iPhone is not the best example, but you can buy yourself like 50% of your future red magic. Anyways, let's have a look at the weapon skins, starting with the show me. This one, amazing. I mean, black silver red like it's so close to the shady fox brand i love this guys the only thing i don't really love about the ironclad skin collection is that we have the aks 74u we have an mp5 skin we have the show me and then the t951 all of them are like low tier weapons or weapons that i don't really use um, this is going to be a nice collection for Dum Dum users. Moving on, we have a tiger ornament, which I actually don't know how this relates to the ironclad uh, collection. I would have assumed we're going to get something that is a dragon, maybe a silver dragon, but you know, maybe I'm not knowing kind of the whole history could happen. And then we have this uh, A and D set attack and defense um which is what is that it's not a sticker it's the thing you can put onto your clothes so guys i think you know more than enough about the ironclad skin collection by now and there's one thing i need to highlight i just cannot let it go i mean if you if you buy the skin like honestly and then you put up a t6 alien helmet you're gonna look so funny I mean, this skin looks nice if you are having all of the accessories and you put up like a, a T4 helmet, like a black one or dark one, eventually with the dark um, face mask, but with the T6 alien helmet, <laughs> guys, it's gonna be ridiculous. I think the best, the best skin in the game is currently this one. Um, I missed it, but this is, this is fresh, this is 2024. This is uh, fitting well with like, you know, Arena Breakout, but this video is about the Ironclad skin collection. And it's important to mention that this video, guys, it's not sponsored or such, okay? So I can freely share my honest opinion. For me, the skin and the guns and the overall, like, I think it's like eight out of 10 for me. The edge, the Katana edge, it's 10 out of 10. Let me, let me, let me grab it again for the motherland so the edge i think it's 10 out of 10 i would love to have that skin the clothes mm, not that much nice skin collection but 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 they are too expensive guys listen to us 
I would love to buy them, but even for me, a guy who has a job, family, house, dog, equipment, all kind of stuff, even for me, it's expensive. Like, why would I spend $200 or $250 or even more on a skin if I can, I don't know, upgrade my, my monitor, for example, for, for that price? I'm kind of talking to the developers right now. If you're watching this, then listen to the community. People would love to spend money, really, but it's just too much. And as I mentioned at the beginning, I'm going to show you some clips, just some bits and pieces, highlights where I play with the katana or any of the other weapon skins. It's not going to be too long, so definitely worth watching. Thank you for your attention. And don't forget, for the motherland, this land is ours. is ours.